Hi guys, today I'm here with the new CBeebies magazine and this is the big summer issue because over in the UK we are entering the summer holidays which is six weeks where kids aren't in school so it's going to be finding things to do for the next six weeks and this is issue 535 and it runs to the 23rd of July and we've got the ice lollies and they do give these away every, every now and again um, but these ones are really cute because look at that, that's a really nice one and the uh, ice cream lollies and ice creams, whoops, I'm going to end up ripping this, is a, uh, one of my favourite toys actually because they're very sturdy so if you have a um, playtime kitchen or something like that, they tend to stay in place really well, they, uh, they really last and you can just incorporate them into your games. Let's see what ice lollies we've got. If you look at these right now, we have got, this is the one I had my eye on, it was like a fruit lolly and it's clear, it's really cute. I like it. Fruit lolly. And we've got this. This is new. I've not seen one like this before. It's like a, a minty flake ice cream. I think it's minty looking anyway. Yum. And then we have a watermelon ice lolly. And then we have this. So it's like a frozen orange ice cream. Yummy. Like a sorbet maybe. And then we have these. It's like a, I can't remember what the brand's called in English, but it's like an ice pot where you push it out like this. And then this is also that one of the ice pops that I used to have when I was little and you would put them in the freezer and then you could cut one side and it'd be like a frozen ice pop in the squeezy pack. And this looks like a orange lolly. Okay. And this is a green, probably, would this be like lime? Apple? We don't really have apple flavoured ice cream, do we? It must be lime. And then finally, another one of those ice pops, like a large one, which is really cool. So yeah, I'm really liking those toys. I think they're adorable. Let's look at the magazine. So the magazine's a bit bigger, physically bigger, this, uh, this one, because it's the summer special, which tends to be a bigger issue with more things to do. I don't know if it's more things to do, but it feels like there's more things to do. So first off, it begins with Sun Hat. So it's learning a summary song with our presenter friends. And then on the next page, there's the Topsy and Tim. Stick on lots of yummy sprinkles. So it's decorating ice creams, whatever you want, whatever you've got around, like pencil crayons, or you could use like, anything really stickers and things up to you then we've got bing bing is the picture sticker page a little padding pool and then we've got hey dougie the sticker story help the squirrels earn their sandcastle badges so we have some stickers with that and then next we've got waffle the wonder dog when i seem to catch it quite a lot on tv some coloring in with a real um background a photo real background and next we have this quite a big maze there this is sarah and duck we have to follow this around and get, wait, I've got stuck already, and get around to the car, which is quite a challenging one. And then we've got some more colouring in, and this is Gold Jetters. Because of course, CBB's magazine includes lots of different characters each time, so it's a good one if you like lots of different cartoons, not just one. And then we've got the swashbuckle game. You will need a small box, green tissue paper, and a paint. <laughs> Make a slot box, oh my goodness. There's some crafting for you guys. Probably more crafting things. I reckon there'll be more crafting things in this issue because it's obviously um, the summer one. And then we've got this, the Peter Rabbit. These are questions. Circle the right pattern. So these are puzzles for you to do. And then next we've got the treasure hunt, which is another uh, cool maze and a game too. And they've got the stickers here. There's the swashbuckle stickers and these. Oh, look at this. What are these? A teeny weeny. And some Bing stickers, some Dougie stickers, and some Octonauts. And then we've got this spot the difference, Moon and Me. When you colour a star, when you spot each change. And then we've got Octonaut sticker, let's go. But of course, if you love the Octonauts, there's also an Octonauts magazine you can get. And then we've got this all about the cup, A. Eh? And the Octo Adventure. Um, and if you watch Octonauts, you probably know about these. The Sunlight Zone, the Twilight Zone, and the Midnight Zone. So of course, the ocean is huge. And then we've got Sunset at Sea, and it says, it's nearly time to go home. Add your stickers to finish the pictures. This is like a midnight kind of thing. It's kind of cool. And then we've got Back to the Octopod, which is a simple maze for you guys. And next we've got Charlie and Lola, and it says, help Lola to write a postcard. So you do some tracing there. The letters are there. You just trace over them. And then we do some drawing. Draw a number block that matches your age. And then we've got colouring in the alpha blocks. 
and then next is a bedtime story from Andy's safari adventure let's go to Rio in Brazil and then the final well the penultimate page is Clangers colouring in okay just there and then the last it says do the monster moves and we made this last time and it was fun and um, you snip this out and then you stick it together Sellotape, tape I think is a bit firmer than glue and when you throw it it gives you an instruction like stretch your arms like Fergus jump like Isabel give a monster mating hug like Vanilla that's a fun thing to do and then next month you've got this CBB's bugs let's explore bugs oh, that's awesome that's another oh, that's, a special, that's a special magazine okay so if you're into bugs that's a good one and there's also the art special which we did the art review you know i've not done that since but i actually really really enjoyed the art magazine i think there's lots and lots to do if you're creative so i hope you guys enjoyed that flick through of the cbb's magazine and i will see you again next time goodbye